Good morning, good morning. I'm in the office today. I got a couple of implant patients. I'm supposed to be off, but I came in anyway today because we had patients to see. We got mouths to make beautiful. Oh, can you feel the beat? Ooh, his sperm count is six million. We need about 20 million. They're not swimming. I hate to call men when they have abnormal semen analysis. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna tell the wife. Can you feel the heat rising up? So what you got going? I'm gonna take Moon for a walk. All right, don't forget to put in my prescriptions, babe. I got you, babe. Thanks, baby. That booty getting tight. <laughs> Can you feel the beat? No, no, never stop. Can you feel the heat rising up? up, up? Oh, oh, that welcome. look good. Look at y'all on time. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey pretty oh. lady. Hey. Really and truly, this is the first time I think we have all met in years. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. But it's good. It is good. I called y'all here for a specific reason. So this Napa trip, it's going to be so much fun. Now that I have this wine collection, I think the best way to introduce it to my friends is by taking them to Napa Valley. I'm going to be visiting with about a group of eight girlfriends to the Sonoma area. I'm looking on your website, and this looks like such a bonding experience. It's truly the magical place. I could take them somewhere where they could step their game up. It's classy, it's serene. It is the ideal girls' trip. Let me just go straight to it. Okay. The bottom line is, us going to Napa, it doesn't make sense for Quad to be there because it's business number one. I'm meeting with the VPs and for real deal VPs of Kendall Jackson, and I, I really and truly want it to be that they see us in a positive light and at the funeral home when she went around to each one of you asking you to accept her back. If you are willing today <clears throat> to let it ride out, I don't give a damn what you said about me. There was never an apology of anything that she had did wrong to anyone. None of us. The resurrection event really left a bad taste in my mouth. And not just up for Maldehyde. Simone Kwa. There was a point in time that you and I had a very close-knit relationship. For the life of me, I don't know where that went. The resurrection was for Quad to basically tell us that she was wiping the slate clean on everything we had done to her. But she hasn't really accepted any responsibility. You and Quad have had moments in time that have been decent. It's just, I don't understand how y'all fall out. Like, literally, I don't get it. When I look back on every situation that we've ever key keyed, as she liked to say, it's always been at the expense of me. Quad has done some things that it's hard to forget. It's in a poor apartment. I ain't been nothing but a friend and to I you. I ain't been nothing but a friend to every time. Can you keep Where's a house? Can that was you in that keep truck? a house? You, you might as well get a mobile home and a double house. wide because you stay on the The only move. mobile home I've ever been in is outside. And then you house. counter and go on social media and call my husband yes. a bitch and, and you join us. I've tried and tried with Quad. It's been 10 years. Like, you can't make this up. Where do we stand with her? I've been a sister to Quad. However, when she has different people in her life or whatever she's got going on, she abandons the relationship. So how, how, how close could it be? And no hard feelings. I still love her. If she was there for me, if she needed anything, I swear to God, I'd be there. Quad does not actually reach out to anyone one-on-one -on -one in this group anymore. She had faith that she no longer needed me and she kind of cut me off. I don't want any more theatrics. Obviously, the way I've been communicating with Quad has not been effective. It's not working. It's not working. Agreed. There needs to be a conversation hell where the three of you are going to state the case to her. We need to hold her accountable and say, you know what, this is your last trip. Am I hearing you say Quad should go to Napa? I mean, I think good friends try to keep all of us together. Right. Bringing Quad on a trip is about allowing Quad another chance for accountability. I feel like I should call Phaedra. And since Phaedra has been bringing her to all the events, she should bring her. 
That way it doesn't seem... We don't seem... care how you get it done. You own it, you fix it, and you move forward. We're giving her an opportunity to be a sister, right? But we need to make sure that she's genuine from the beginning. Well, we got it. We got, okay. a, we got a plan. We just need to set the tone. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. We do going yeah. forward. You know yeah. what I mean? Power for This? The core. Is the core. Yeah. Set the, the core foundation. Four. Can we get a t-shirt? <laughs> <laughs> no, not the t-shirt. <laughs>